Yeah, well, you might notice yesterday's thumbnail was basically from the same spot because I took it this morning. <laughs> but that's all right. Yeah. Hopefully I don't hit my screen on this one, but good morning, everybody. Happy Saturday. It is a new work week. Yes, it is. Okay. Yeah, and I goofed up. I didn't pay my one, my Capital One, because I was waiting for this check, and yep, there we go. Screwed up. Didn't pay it yesterday, so now I got a late fee. <sighs> thought I had everything taken care of, at least scheduled. And it's literally not written on my sheet that I put any money down for it. So and it's an oversight on my part, but oh well, taken care of now. So, so I even lost money what I thought I had this week. <laughs> not good. I'm gonna stop at the bank on my way to work anyway, so I'm gonna get myself around here pretty soon because I gotta jump in the shower. 6:31. All right, we well, are showered and dressed and ready to go at 20 minutes early. And like I said, I do have to stop at the bank, so. Oh, get money in, but um, good, yeah. Well, things are sounding pretty good, at least currently for the uh, for Lamar Hamlin. He's uh, awake, making Zoom calls to the team, moving his hands, his feet. Um, definitely a hell of an improvement. I mean, it's uh, good to hear. Good to you know. I think that's going to be a huge catalyst for Buffalo to play knowing that their, their teammate is doing as well as he is, and they're going to, I think, play really hard for him. <laughs> so, plus they're at home, so it'd be nice. Definitely Sunday, I want to try to get out with the dogs a little bit early so that we are home for the 1 o'clock game. Um, I'm thinking I might either make my way to Snappy's or someplace to get my Reuben and uh, try to thoroughly enjoy the final game of the season. I'm still kind of... Uh, confused. I don't think anybody really knows how this whole ranking is going to play out. Um, but by the sounds of it, basically Buffalo has to win and Kansas has to lose for this number one seed thing. But it sounds like they're going to do neutral field regardless for whoever's number one seed. They're not going to give them home field advantage to make it fair across the board. <clears throat> Which has, I think, some people pretty pissed. But it's what it is. I mean, there was really no great answer for this whole situation and yeah it is what it is okay well it's almost time to get ready on the saturday morning long day eight to six but uh hey one of the travel days i had <laughs> eight to six is kind of a drop in the bucket anymore all right so this is this is kind of the neat thing is i can tuck this chair back and i have the whole room wide open so the problem I'm having with my beautiful chair is the fact that whoever bought it originally was a smoker. And last night I'm sitting here and I'm starting to get sick from the smell of cigarette smoke. As a former smoker, it does not vote well for you. <laughs> well, especially the longer you go. So I've been spraying it. I don't know if I'm hurting it or not. Um, I used Febreze on it last night, which this morning it was stronger, but I put that on it this morning, which is another Febreze. It's a fabric spray, but I'm not sure if it's going to... I don't think it's doing anything to it, but I'm trying to get the... If anybody has any uh, better ideas how to get a smoke smell out of a gaming chair, it's... I, I mean, I don't think that's leather. I think it's leather or some, you know, whatever material, but... Yeah, hopefully eventually the smell will come out. I mean, if I just keep hitting it with something, being in our house, it'll be better. I don't remember the delay being quite as much as it's been lately on the uh, watch. Of course, I am using the 6 because I put the other one on the charger. Because I accidentally ran my exercise thing overnight, so I wanted to charge it. It would have made the day, but it doesn't matter. They're both, uh, they're both top of the line when they were. <laughs> so. Oh, righty. Got out of here just in time. I think I have enough time to hit the bank and still get to work on time. Drew sent, gave me his cell phone money yesterday, and then Terry wrote a check for the house so I can pay Comcast, so I don't not late on another bill. I gotta clean my glasses when I get to work. I think I ruined my one Zeiss rag with my one pair of sunglasses. I got something on them, and it keeps spreading it all over my lenses. Very frustrating. Yeah, I pulled them out last night. I didn't even bring my contacts with me. It's supposed to be another gloomy day, I think. 41 for the high. Tomorrow's a little bit nicer to get the dogs out. Maybe have a little bit of a, get some exercise prior to 
sitting at home watching football. So, yeah, I'm telling you, I haven't, I really haven't gotten that much into, you know, football. I, I get very frustrated, but I'm, I'm trying. <laughs> the last couple of years, it's just been like the Bills just keep getting closer and closer. <sighs> I'm hopeful, but we'll see. Yeah, so I, like I said, I, I don't know, but the one thing I did hear was that, you know, like I said, Kansas City had a lose, Buffalo had a win. I don't know if it really matters what Cincinnati does. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. But I think more of the seed is between Kansas and Buffalo. And they can't have an even record because of that game being just basically a, a no game. I mean, I have... <clears throat> I get it. I mean, that was a different circumstance than a player was injured and carted off and was like, you know, at life. So, a lot of people are... I really haven't heard too many, well, this game should have been played. That's one thing I've not heard, which is, it's that would be inaccurate. I think they did the right call. So, but that's, of course, I'm a Bills fan. Of course, Cincinnati didn't want to play the game anymore in Buffalo because everybody was shook up. So, okay, enough on that get to work um i did to the, so this morning I, again i was playing with the snap grip i'm getting a little bit more used to holding it i'm figuring where to put my fingers so that i'm not touching the screen uh to play with the zoom levers i i just i'm just at a loss for what to do with this audio yesterday's audio still seemed like there was a problem um i don't know i'm gonna have to look at things felt like there was like a reverb or an echo or something going on not had that problem. Of course, it could be the fact I'm using the TV. I might have to just put my TV on standard audio. I think it's set on movie or something, so that could be goofing me up, and I'm making adjustments that I don't need to be making. But like I said, uh, Mike, simply your devices did comment saying the audio was good. So, yeah. Puppy dogs. We just got a snow alert from Weather Channel for our area. Okay. I was not aware of. I said, I don't been watching the weather too much. Especially work days. It's like, I'm trapped inside. I don't get to see much. Just for anybody, it's like, I really have to talk much about it. I am truly enjoying the change. And uh, something I realized, remember I was talking a few weeks back, two months back, starting to have a lot of ear problems. It was mainly in this side, and this is the side that I always had my... Um, Ear, ear thing in for my walking because we had I'd gotten the, the kind of like what Secret Service wear so it was an earplug it was pushing the wax into my eardrum and it's finally getting itself cleared out so not only has my I hate to say this because my mental health being frustrated all the time dropped down but physically you know that's one thing that's not happening anymore either no, don't get me wrong, this morning I woke up with a massive sinus issue in this side because I actually went to bed last night and sleeping all the way on my side like I do in bed causes more sinus issues than when I sleep on the recliner because I don't quite sleep. I actually have been sleeping on this side, so yeah, the recliner's actually been a little bit better off for me. When I go to bed, I get way more sinus pressure. That's not good. Hello, everybody. Oh, not a bad day. I'm still getting comfortable with things, but I'm getting there. It's going to take some time. I already know this. I keep saying this over and over again, but every day I feel a little bit more. So it's just... <clears throat> we're still trying to figure out who to... We got, we got an applicant, plus we got an internal that wants to come over. So I'm trying to figure that out, um, which is so much fun. But, uh, and it's just, you know, <sighs> there's so much to do and we just can't get it all with what we've got right now. Because I feel bad if I'm out on the floor trying to get something accomplished and leaving them by themselves if they get with a doctor there. He was behind all day today. <clears throat> he bucked out of there like a, like a freaking cannon. He just 
20 minutes at 5. He was gone. I'm like, you. Uh, so. Uh, but. Ready to go home, see the puppies. I know Cray wasn't feeling good yet this morning, which means the medication isn't working, which really pisses me off. <clears throat> this dog is. It's not her fault. But the vet not figuring out what the hell's wrong with her is starting to get on my nerves. So, I don't know. She's not doing number two right. Just, I'm hoping she didn't eat something she shouldn't have and has a blockage. Because she's not going right. But I'm going to get a good walk in tomorrow with him. Hopefully the weather is somewhat decent. Because Tim is going to go up and get his truck finally. And meet us right around 2.30, 3 o'clock. So dogs might get double park walk tomorrow because I'm going to try to get out of the house early and take them. Um, still on the fence what to do with the TV. With, I mean, if I run everything through the Mac, I can edit while things are going, but it's kind of defeating the purpose. <laughs> and if I hook, like, yeah, the TV to it or a gaming console, again, I'll be off of the computer and of course, then I can just put the computer in my lap, and then that defeats the whole purpose of doing this whole thing anyway. So, I don't know. Well, I, I just can't understand why some of these older gaming systems are still as expensive as they are. It makes no sense to me whatsoever. Probably because getting anything at all right now is near impossible. Anywho, alright. Get home. I don't know. I'm torn whether or not I'm going to stay up and watch... I don't know if any football's left on. It might be over now. I thought they said it was a night game. I can't remember who they said was playing. I think Kansas City is literally pummeling the Raiders, which was my only hope for Buffalo to be number one. Them losing, so. Whatever. Okay, cat. Hey, Joe. All right. Well, Flash still came on for the iPhone, but I am also using the snap grip light at full velocity, so that should be a bright shot. But the question is, how well does it work for video for the front-facing camera? So since the snap grip is a little hard to use facing backwards, can I use it this way to film at night? Um, the front-facing camera, and what the quality looks like. So in the comments, let me know what you think. And uh, yeah, maybe we figured out a little trick here. I think that's at full velocity. It wasn't. That might be. Let's see here. Let me play with this a second. Oh, that's even brighter. Even brighter. Yeah, so I was on the dimmest one. <laughs> How does that look? Okay, now the flash on the back might not turn on now. Using the full power of it. Not sure how many lumens it is. I'd have to look and see, but uh, really convenient. Even if you don't have the snap grip, it'll still mag safe to your phone without it. So it's kind of a cool little feature to have. What you doing, princess? Baby girl's not feeling well again, and of course, Terry was reading up on the medication the doctor gave her. A, it's supposed to be prescribed for 10 days. B, it also can give them nausea, stomach ache, uh, and a few other side effects. Fantastic things the dog already has problems with. She's got more of. We gotta figure this gulping out, though, because it's getting ridiculous. She was gulping as soon as she started barking when I came home. I see. She's getting, air in her. She's getting air in her stomach. That's all there's to it. I don't know how you stop that from happening. Come on. Still not beeping. Hold my volume all the way up. Hmm. I might have it on silent. Oh, I don't have it on silent either. There we go. You gotta turn the volume on the ringer up too. So. All right. Yeah, I'm trying to get the, shift, the snap grip a little bit of a, a use, especially considering the fact that I've had such problems with audio with the other thing kind of want to see if this will actually work on it, even though I didn't think it was going to. So one bad part, bad part about this thing is you have to literally turn it all the way back up each and every time you turn it off. So if you want the brightest light, you gotta turn it on, go through the four or five stages. I can't really remember. Where I, so what I was about to say is, my sunglass frames never left Harrisburg until recently. They're still not even in Williamsport. They're still supposed to be here tonight at nine o'clock. They ain't coming. I'm mad. Because I'd be surprised if they come tomorrow. 
They're not gonna cry come to Monday, so I won't have them tomorrow to use. It does make a good light for uh, if she went potty though, which she's not doing. Car car was running, she was scared of it. <laughs> so you run away. Uh, we're living on a cloudy side tonight. I don't think we're gonna see any moon tonight. Boy, I tell you, your hand still just almost touches the screen, even just holding it normally. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna see any stars tonight. Either. I think the moon's right over there. Eh, we might get a clearing at some point. Honestly, I think the extra light might be beneficial for this guy in the dark. <laughs> Prius, she already shows up pretty good, but Mateo, he needs the extra lighting for his dark little fur. So, well, Prius still didn't do a business. She pedaled, but that's it. It's got me concerned. Might just give her some pork and sauerkraut and let her crap it out. It'll blow anything out of her that she's got. And that's gonna be my dinner. Everybody wants to wander all the way out there for some reason. You know where they're going. He's going to fire hydrant. Yeah, he thinks that's like, you know, the dog thing to do. <laughs> yeah, someone doesn't think Christmas is over. <laughs> it's alright. It's nice to see some lights still. You get mine down one of these days, it gets nice out. Oh, sorry. At least she's making a ton of noise. There we go. I just dropped one of the bag holders. It just fell off a carabiner. The carabiner was wide open. Not sure why. It actually went past the stop. Yeah, I'm going to be honest with this particular system. I think this is the smartest way to go with it. Just use the front facing camera because it is, there's nothing really to grip. Like I said, I'm touching the screen as it is. The Max is a little big for this. It works, don't get me wrong. It's better for taking photos and definitely filming forward. But uh, and that was the moon. It is trying to come up now. I might keep my eye out, maybe get a picture later if I can. Oh, that's a lap with him so far. And I'm ready for dinner. Not too bad, I guess. I had a good shot, and then of course the damn thing went out of sync as soon as I hit record. Clouds have kind of gotten away now. But it dropped my uh, exposure all the way down. If that's the trick. What are you saying? What are you saying? You saying you want to play? You want to play? You. you want to play? You said you're beautiful, puppy. Get so big. Five months old. The guy just came home. Yep, five months old. Hey, stop. Before I beat you. <laughs> he literally just scared the dog. He barked at him and he ran away. <laughs> Look at the size of his tail, dude. You crazy little dog. I'm trying here, folks. Getting this thing to lock on the moon for the S22 is a pain in the butt. But that's max out, 20X. Got a really cool picture though. Yeah. All right, clouds are flowing. I'll try to get the big camera out here later. All right, like I mentioned, we put the uh, put Archie and the one catfish that was alive. Archie's in the bubbles over here. He was moving around a little bit. Yeah. He looks better than he did. I think he's he's getting old, unfortunately. Aren't you, buddy? You getting old? Yeah. Hey, is that a fishy? Is that a fishy, buddy? <laughs> Tells like, what's up there? What are we watching? We're watching Archie. 